Megan abandoned her occupation with a puzzled frown. The noise was coming from the river nearby, a soft but persistent meowing. She squinted and headed towards the water's edge. What could be causing such a disturbance? She expected to see a bird or another animal in distress. However, what she encountered was far more heart-wrenching than she could have ever imagined. There, in the middle of the river, was a tiny, soaked kitten, barely six months old. It was meowing pitifully, its fur matted and eyes wide with fear. Megan's heart ached for the poor creature and she called out to it, encouraging it to swim to safety. But the kitten wouldn't budge. It stayed in one spot, fighting to stay afloat, yet unwilling to move an inch. Megan couldn't understand why until she shifted her position slightly and saw the dreadful truth. The kitten was tethered by some sort of strange cable that anchored it in place. Desperation filled the kitten's eyes and it was clear that the tiny animal wouldn't last much longer. Yet reaching it was no easy task. The river was deep and swift and Megan knew she needed help. With her heart pounding, she called out for assistance. Thankfully, her friend Jessica Searle heard the cries for help and rushed to the scene. Without a second thought, Jessica waded into the deep river, moving towards the struggling kitten. She carefully grabbed the trembling creature along with the heavy object that was attached to the cable. With all her strength, she fought against the current, determined to bring the kitten to safety. Gasping and exhausted, Jessica finally reached the shore. She released the frightened kitten and retrieved the strange stone tied to the cable. But what they found sent shivers down their spines. The cat had been tethered with a cord from an electric saw and the circular blade had served as a horrifying anchor to the riverbed. It was a malicious and deliberate act of cruelty. With the cable finally cut, they rushed the shivering kitten to a nearby veterinary clinic. The veterinarian confirmed that the cat had no microchip, making it impossible to trace its owner. However, the state of the kitten's fur, whiskers, and even eyelashes suggested that the person responsible for this heinous act was beyond deranged. Megan and Jessica named the kitten Splash. Now Splash lives with Jessica, basking in the love and care that had been so cruelly denied to it before.